hi guys welcome to my youtube channel today in this video i am going to talk about what is culvert what are the shapes of culvert and what are the advantages of the culvert so in order to understand this video don't forget to watch it completely also press on the bell icon so that you can be notified of my new videos First of all, we are going to talk about what is culvert. You can see the definition. Culvert is a closed tunnel or conduit which is used to convey water from one side or area to another side. Normally, it is used to carry water from one side of the road to the other side. It comes in different shapes. Now, we are going to talk about the shapes. Commonly, they are box shaped, elliptical and round in cross section. They are also used to carry rainwater runoff along, away or under the highways or motorways. Now let me give you the details of the design or the shape. As I've talked about the shapes, we have box shape. You can see that this is the cross section. This is the cross section of the box okay and this is the box shape now elliptical elliptical can be like this vertically elliptical or horizontally elliptical okay like this and the last one it is the round round is always going to be a circle is going to be a circle okay it is always going to be in the circular shape so these are the three basic types or shapes that you can find whenever we are doing the construction of culvert these shapes can be used according to the topography and according to the demand of the area now the last part of our video is advantages of the culvert so you can see the advantages here it can be constructed with any desired strength. It means you can provide the reinforcement, concrete cover or thickness, all these things, the mixed design, all these things can be uh, you know, used so that you can give it more strength and the desired strength can be achieved, okay? They are pocket friendly or they are economical. They are not that expensive and then you can use them so that the water can cross over and your structure which is road can be protected so it is not that expensive the third part here is they can bear any tensile or compressive stresses any of the stresses which is of tensile or compressive they can be bound by the structure okay water crossing is under the structure you know whenever we are constructing the culvert water can be crossed under the culvert so that your structure will remain protected and the structure i mean your road is not going to be disturbed so water can cross over and your structure is remaining protected okay the last part is vehicles can cross over the culverts when we are designing or when we are constructing the culvert the vehicles can also cross over on the top of the culvert while the water is passing through or is passing under the culvert so as such, two things can be achieved with the help of culvert, okay? So this topic was for today. I believe that you have understood it. I tried to explain it in very simple words. However, still you have any confusion or comments, questions, you can let me know. Feel free to contact me. I'm going to provide my contact details. So I believe it is okay for today. So thank you so much for watching today's video. Until my next video. Goodbye.